All right, everyone, welcome to Rotting Acres Mall. Uh, if you're just joining us for the first time, this is, I believe, the only virtual mall that exists on YouTube. And uh, last episode, we added some more stores to the third floor. We're a three-story mall now, as of a couple episodes ago. This is one of the stores we added, a Suncoast. And then what else did we add the last episode? I know we added some other stuff. What do we got here? Oh yeah, that's right. We added a Ritz camera also. I want to add a couple more stores uh, this episode. Let's get them all going. So yeah, last time, like I said, uh, DS Storage is asking what we had last time. We added a Ritz. We added a uh, Suncoast. Oh look, we broke, we're breaking 500 uh, customers now, that's good. Add a Pokemon shop. I, I want to add a pizza place. I do want to add a pizza place. I think I do want to add a showbiz, maybe on the third floor. One of your employees is blocked from completing his rounds. we got to figure that out, what the deal is there. So something else that I realize our store doesn't have. Let's take a look at our store list here. Wow, we are busy. Look at that. Take a quick look at our store list. There we've got our Sun Coast and our Ritz camera. Oh yeah, Rotten Tees. We added a custom uh, a custom t-shirt store also. Uh, I do not remember Gaylord's My Little Disco Light. Is that a, I'm guessing that's a department store. Uh, we don't have a Gadzooks, but I remember that name. What was Gadzooks? So what? What else? I want to. I want to make sure we don't have a. Um, I feel like that music is a little loud. The uh, music for this episode is actually from Dan Mason. It's his uh, album Electric Elevator, which is a good one. I used it in my 99 cent store video. Hopefully, he doesn't mind that I'm using it. <laughs> I don't think he will. Yeah, I want to make sure we don't have a Hallmark, because we do not have a Hallmark store. We have a Mervyn's now. Yeah, we need a Hallmark. Am I not going to be able to put... What are these guys doing? Okay, yeah, so we want to build. Uh, build a store. Oh, nope, vertical store. Okay, and then as far as we want to do, I believe collectibles is one of the things we can do. Let me see here. Yeah, collectibles. And I don't think greeting cards is one of the options, which is silly. Let me make sure, though. Candles is, of course. Or that's perfume. Dry cleaning. Yeah, I think we'll use the calendars. For our Hallmark. Yeah, that looks like a Hallmark store. Gadzooks was clothing. They tried to sell to trendy young folk. I remember, I like barely remember Gadzooks. I, I think I remember seeing them in the mall, but I don't think, um, I don't think I ever actually went in into there before. There we go. Now we got a Hallmark. And uh, I actually think I'm kind of okay with the way that... Yeah, I actually think that looks like a Hallmark. Like, that actually looks like the Hallmark that's at Superstition Springs Mall. Cool, that'll do. That will do. Cool. Where's this person going? 
We got a male customer here with 127 bucks on him going to Suncoast. That's a dangerous place to go with 127 bucks in your pocket. I guess now 75 it says, so we know he spent money. That's cool. Wow, that looks just like a Suncoast. Ron John Skate Shops, I remember. I actually see more of the Ron John stickers than the actual shops. Okay, so that's cool. Now he's going to Auntie Anne's. Look at all these people waiting for the elevator. That's cool. Okay, let's not... I don't want to follow him anymore. Okay, there we go. Gosh, we're already running out of room... We're already running out of room on the third floor because I didn't I didn't make it. Let me look at something real quick. Hmm. I'm trying to see where we can add our our that's where we can put it, I think. Hold on. Yeah, that's where we can put it. Okay, I got an idea. Sorry, just taking a minute to look at the chat here, guys. I gotta catch up. You remember $40 anime VHS tapes at Suncoast? I remember that. I do remember that. I bought... You know what? I think I bought more video games, actually, than movies at, at Suncoast. Sears had the most shoppers this month. Interesting. Okay, so I have an idea. Can we stick... Whoops, I always click that thinking that's the build. Let's see. Why can't I build that there? Why can't I build on top of the movie theater? Oh, I have to put floor first, derp. Okay, hold on. I want to I want to make sure I put the right amount of floor. I'm having to get creative. We we built this I say we, I built this so weird. Yeah, that should work. We can stick it there. Okay. So I need to build the floor. Um, and I don't think it's going to matter what floor. I mean, I'll pick the floor that matches what we're using here. But I don't think it's going to matter because... Oh, is it one past? Nope, we need a little bit more floor. Little bit more floor. Like one more strip should do it. There we go. Well, I feel like we should be putting this in the third floor, but this will work. New store added. Okay, now we need. We need pizza, and we need <laughs> song is ridiculous. I love it. There we go. Cool. We put in... So now now here's what we need to vote on, though. Is this a Chuck E. Cheese or a Showbiz Pizza? Yeah, we're going to figure out a drugstore next, I think, on the third floor. We'll figure, we'll figure out something that makes sense. But do we want this to be a Chuck E. Cheese or a Showbiz? 
Showbiz. I got one vote for Showbiz. I'm voting Showbiz. We got a Chucky. Showbiz. Chucky. Not Pizza Hut. It's looking pretty even. And now some more Showbiz. Okay, that's now Showbiz. Show. Okay, we're going to do Showbiz Pizza. Showbiz Pizza. I don't even know if malls had Showbiz Pizzas, but ours does. Dude, the rent is way too high. Oh, wait. There are, let's do this. And I mean... Whoa, that's too much sales cut. Hold on. There. There we go. And then... Not happy with the way I like I like the front of it, but that's not whimsical enough, you know, for a showbiz. It needs to be No, that's ridiculous. <laughs> hmm. Well these th none of those will work because those are all Corner pieces. I think my showbiz had red carpet when I was a kid. Let's see here. Tough choice. There we go. We'll do we'll do we'll do red curtains because then we can pretend that the Rocket Fire Explosion show is behind the curtains. <laughs> That'll work. Alright. Back to the third floor. We need a drugstore. And I like the idea of a drugstore on the third floor because a drugstore is somewhere people commonly have to go. So we'll make him go all the way to the third floor to do it. Damn, we are running out of room. Hmm. Where can we stick it? Yeah, we. I, I laid this mall out real stupid-like. <laughs> but that's okay. What is this right here? We could wedge it in there. That won't work. What if I... Hold on. Okay, I got an idea. I got an idea. Hold on. I know how we can do this. Uh, let's see. Where's the floors? You know what's funny is Walgreens... Like, that was always the big joke when I was a kid. Is it going to let me do this because there's no floor? Uh... Shoot. Hold on. This might not work. Hmm. Yeah, I would have to build something above that. So that might not work, actually. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I... Let's, uh, just, where is a good place to stick? I want to stick it on the third floor, but I want to stick it somewhere where it makes sense. 
Let's see here. Hold on. If I put this here, how much? That pretty much blocks that. Uh huh? Makes a weird hallway. What is that store there? Oh, that's our Schlotzky's. That's right, we put a Schlotzky's in on the third floor. Hmm. Actually, yeah, let's do that. That gives me an idea. Hold on. Because then we can... Do, do, let's see. There, look, then we can put tables there. Okay. Boom. We are really screwing stuff here, here, but that's okay. Oops. Okay. So let's see. We can do... How do we do a drugstore? Let's see here. What is it? That's tattoos. That's right. Dry cleaning. No, no. I mean, perfume, that's like, was that could make it look like it, but isn't there like a vitamin? Yeah, I think it's here. Hold on. Sporting goods, de a dentist, yeah. Okay, makeup and bath goods and vitamins and health food. That should do it, right? Oh, pharmacy. And then makeup and bath goods, right? Yeah. There we go. All right, now, whoa, whoa, calm down. Now, what are we calling our drugstore? Is this a Walgreens? Is it an Osco? Is it an Eckerd's? What do you guys think? What are you guys feeling? Benjamin Franklin's Parisian tug and tan. <laughs> Far more. Rotting Acres Dispensary? That's a good one. No, I want to go with a... Uh... Not Walgreens. Yeah, Walgreens is too obvious. We've got Drug Emporium, Eckerd's. Far more I'm not familiar with. Rite Aid. Are they even around anymore? Walgreens were the ones that were in the malls that I remember as a kid. And you guys are all over the place. Yeah, I'm going to go with Drug and or Walgreens. Let's do Rite Aid. That's the one I've seen the most votes for. And Rite Aids were pretty much like Walgreens. Okay, cool. Cool. Where is this employee blocked? I mean, I say I see a lot of employees standing around not doing anything, but I don't see where they're actually blocked. I'll have to figure that out. We're going to have to figure out, too... I might have screwed up... And made this where, uh, that's enough of that. Um, I may have made this where we kind of screwed up where we, uh, can't really expand the third floor that much. Cause I can't get, Auntie Anne's had the most shoppers this month. Yeah, we'll have to see. I'm gonna have to study this deeper. What I need to do one day is make like, I'd love to make a mall directory. I just saw the UFO go flying by there. Stealing customers. Well, we are our customer counts dropping when well, now it's raising again. And the mayor calls them all an aesthetic asset. Let's see what's going on on the first floor. We haven't checked that out in a while. 
Oh, it's Christmas right now. It is literally Christmas Day. Oh, now it's the day after Christmas. Mall is busy for Christmas Day. Can we hire more employees? I don't think so. I don't think so. Hmm. Okay. I want to run some ads and stuff, man. We got to get this. Get the small jumping. Yeah, the mall was open Christmas Day. I don't give a crap about my employees. <laughs> Especially that one that's blocked. Now we got a car show going on. I love the car show because the cars remind me of... Um, like the cars in Test Drive. I don't know if you guys ever played like Test Drive on the PC, but that's what that reminds me of. It was like the Lamborghini Countach and stuff that you could drive in Test Drive. Google says an incomplete floor could cause stuck employees. Okay, well, I have to figure out where the floor is incomplete because I'm pretty sure I have it like walled off and everything. So we'll have to figure that out the next episode. It doesn't seem to be negatively impacting us too much because I see that, I mean, I see it fluctuate a little bit, the customer count, but then it goes back up again. So. There's that damn UFO. And I know I, I the Men in Black is supposed to take care of the UFO. And I've got plenty of them already, so. Take a look here at the mall. We actually don't have any loans, which is good, too. We are still debt-free. And our mall approval rating is 6? Is that good or bad? I don't... Oh. Oh. Well, that doesn't look good. Why? Why is our mall not liked? Huh. That is weird. There's one other thing I wanted to look and see if we could do this episode. It was expand. We might not do it this episode, but it, it turns out there's another... Whoops. There's a bigger... um movie theater than this like uh, I forget what they're I think they're under special structures let's look real quick yeah because what we have is a movie theater and uh, cinema I think is bigger let's look real quick oh wow that's really big that's probably too big Wow, that's huge. I don't even think that'll fit in that spot. Where could we expand and add a cinema? I'll have to figure that out. The play area, too, is another thing we don't have yet. But it's not as big. We could always stick the play area right here. Or can we put that on the third floor? I don't think there's anywhere we could conveniently stick this right now either. We can't stick it over the atrium. Hmm. Well, you guys will have to let me know what you guys think the next episode, what we're going to have. I, I think we're going to wrap it up here because we're at about we're at about half an hour. A zombie has changed one of your... Oh, crap. The mall's dying, guys, again. Because one of our employees has been blocked too long. We're going to have to figure that out the next episode. We're going to have to figure out the blocked employee. I just noticed that, that we've got a zombie infestation in the mall. This has happened before at Rotting Acres Mall, so... Uh, hopefully we can we can tackle that that issue in the uh, in the next episode. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Oh, also I keep forgetting to mention also uh, Rotting Acres Mall merchandise and apparel is now available at the uh, Retail Archaeology uh, merchandise store. I'll put a link down in the description below. But if you just go to Teespring.com and search Retail Archaeology, you should be able to find it. But there's Retail Archaeology T-shirts and now there's actually also uh, Rotting Acres Mall T-shirts. 
Um, also, if you haven't checked out um, the video that I released earlier this week on Best Buy and them not carrying CDs, also check that out as well. That was a that was a pretty good one, I think. I enjoyed making that one. So, um, oh hey, Big Red Tower, thanks again for the uh, thanks for the uh, super chat there. I think you did that last episode too. That's much appreciated. Oh, also episode 16 so the archive for episode 16 actually just became available um today because the copyright claim finally got lifted i i used the rotting or uh, the uh, multi-coon music and uh got copyright flagged for it but they actually released it so oh thank you robert that's that's a, there's another super chat there i appreciate that it's very nice of you anyways like i said if you guys haven't checked out the videos that came out this week there's the best buy video that came out earlier this week and then uh the last episode of rotting acres mall uh, is actually available for viewing now. And then this one um, should be available uh, later on this weekend to view if you're just not joining us. I always post the archives later on. So I hope you guys all enjoyed and uh, have a good night from Rotting Acres Mall.